Hey there, you probably stumbled upon a bash MySQL command not found error when you try to run MySQL command from the bash terminal, or the MySQL is not recognized as an internal or external command error when you try to run a MySQL command from the command prompt. So in this video, I'll walk you through simple steps you can take to fix the MySQL command not found error on a Windows machine. The error occurs because Windows can find the MySQL program even though it's probably already installed. So to fix this, we need to add the MySQL executable to the path environment variables. Let's do that. Open up the search bar and search for env and click the edit the system environment variables. Then go to the environment variables section. And here you'd have to decide if you want to add MySQL only for the current user, which in my case is Carol, or you want MySQL to be globally available for any users that are using your machine. I will go ahead and add it as a system variable as I'm the only user on my machine. Go ahead and select path, then edit, click new, and now add the path to MySQL's bin folder. If you are using the MySQL server, then most likely the path is C program files mysql mysql server version i think 8 is the last one and then bin but in my case i'm using xamp so the path is c xamp mysql and then bin Great, now click OK, OK, and then again OK. Now let's see if we can use MySQL through Bash. If you're using Git Bash in VS Code, like I do, you'll have to restart VS Code first because it's currently unaware of the new system variable we just added. All right, so now let's run MySQL Bash V to get the MySQL version. And yeah, as you can see, now we are able to run any MySQL commands we want. Let's also test this using command prompt. MySQL dash V. And yeah, we can use MySQL through command prompt as well. All right, guys, that was it. I hope this video helped you get MySQL working on your machine. Stick around this channel for more similar zero cost content. And if you have any feedback, comments, or concerns, Leave them in the comment section and I will do my best to respond to all of them. See you in the next one.